Hello, dear Pisces. Hope you are well, fam. We are checking in for your energies. We're clearing the space. We've already shuffled the decks. Um, and let's just get going and see what is happening for you right now. And we'll look at, guys, what your current situation is and how we can best support your journey. We're going to look at what the challenge, what the what's hidden and then the outcome so current situation pisces financial constraints we've got the temple path one more thank you spirit okay we've got two angel of strength and the door to value nice pisces so it seems like there is some concern around money or whether there's got enough, whether you're going to be financially supported is what's coming through in terms of the current challenge. Um, just to let you know, this is, again is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising energy. You may be a cross watcher. This is a timeless read and a general one and may be vice versa energy. So take what resonates, loves, and I really do hope you get the answers that you need today. Um, so... When I look at this Pisces, something is really working in your favor. I, I, I have seen this and I keep continuing to see this for you Pisces regarding something that you are pursuing, something that you are going after and something that you want to accomplish here. It's interesting. This temple path also keeps showing up. So I feel like you're a bit of a bit of a on a bit of a like spiritual journey, but I see you kind of skipping towards something. It's explorative. It has depth and it has meaning to you. So I really like this with the angel of strength here showing up next to door to value. I feel this is spirit saying, keep the faith Pisces, keep the trust, keep the openness on what's available. Everything that is provided to you, every step that you take, every choice that you make, when it is spirit led, when you connect into that and trust in that, it's amazing what unfolds for you. Okay. Faith is so incredibly powerful. It allows you to surrender to anything that you may be trying to hold on to or trying to control to get the result. And tr that trust just has so much significance in your life. Um, you may not realize the power of it, but the more faith that you have, the more strength that you hold to that faith, we're going to see things open up for you. Okay. So let's have a look at what might be hidden or the influence here. <laughs> okay, it says it, daughter wealth, worried about fi financial constraints. What's hidden is sudden wealth coming on through. We've also got toil and labor. This is really interesting, Pisces. Let's get one more here. This is in terms of what's hidden, all the influences, and then we've got family room. So there's something that's changing regarding the way that you work, regarding the way that you do things. It's going to expand around your home life, around a place that you connect, where it feels safe, where it feels supported. So I've, I really like this Pisces, something's changing, okay? So I feel like the winds are blowing into new, new ways and new territory here for you, okay? So let's dive in a little bit deeper and see what the challenge is and what you need to know. So we've got six of cups, five of wands, and the ten of wands. So when we look into this Pisces, I mean, the challenge is let it, I feel like there's some lessons that you're learning. Um, and sometimes the lesson can be that faith part, that faith piece, that surrendering, that trust. Um, it could be just like also an important lesson that you've had to learn along this path and journey. If it's around your finances, it might be how to better manage it, how to, you know, how, yeah, how to work with it is what I feel is, you know, strongly coming up, but also remembering that when you have a strong desire, when you want to go after it, when you have this belief in yourself and the possibility of something, what can create and transpire. So I feel this is really wonderful, Pisces. Um, I feel the game's just changing where you've been working hard, kind of like this sweat laborious intensive work that just isn't fulfilling this is changing for you okay i really feel this is changing for you but for things to change there's two there's two parts that come come with it okay if that's something that you really want this change because i can hear some people kind of saying well yeah but it doesn't happen for me okay that's great if it doesn't happen for you it doesn't happen for you 
and there's a reason it doesn't happen for you is because you keep entering in that energy. When it does happen for you is that the energy and the willingness to create that change. You are very powerful Pisces to be able to do something different, to be able to change the path. It doesn't mean it's going to happen overnight, but the universe wants to deliver it to you. But you've also got to send signs and signals to the universe that you really want it. Okay, to spirit that you want it or to ask for help when you need it, to be grateful when you don't have it. There's that all those things add up. So for you, for for your heart, for your goodness, for this path forward, just keep remembering that that one step at a time makes a difference. Even just shifting the mindset when you feel like you're coming from a place of like, it doesn't happen for me. How about start changing? It does happen for me. There's different energy. It doesn't happen for me. It does happen for me. It doesn't happen for me. It does happen for me. It does happen for me. It will happen for me. Watch me. You know, that energy just is so different, Pisces. Even practice it with yourself when you say these things and recognize how you feel when you change the way that you talk about yourself or talk about your situation, okay? Because what I see is happening is that whatever's transpired or, or again, I'm just getting something that, some lesson that you need to learn. This might be a lifetime thing, like a destined thing that you've had to learn on this lifetime and this purpose-driven life that you're in is like, there's going to be conflicts of where to put your energy. And I can see this. This might be conflicts of dealing with people, trying to get a result. And you feel burdened. You feel burdened in having to make decisions, having to make choices because you can't see ahead. You can't see in front of you. What if you just let them all go? What happens? There's open space. All right. So just be mindful of that Pisces on where this is going, where this is leading and how you can support your journey. So let's have a look at what um, is in terms of your power in this situation. What does Pisces need to know for their power in this situation? Yeah, taking a leap, taking a leap and trusting in yourself, Pisces, with the full energy. We've got the three of cups and the three of pentacles. Boom, boom. I like it because you know why, Pisces? This is basically saying that when you take a chance on yourself, when you trust in yourself, when you trust that the universe has your back, things come together. The right people come together. You are allowed to have fun with it. You're allowed to celebrate it. And sometimes, you know, that we play it safe when... There's a little bit of fear of what if, you know, what if it doesn't work out? What if, you know, I don't make it? What are people going to think? Okay, that's great. But what if it is successful? What if you have the right people along the way? What if this works out? What if you get to celebrate it? What if there's more to this story than you actually realize? Okay. Okay. So this is again about reframing the way you might be thinking about a situation, because what I see here is people really coming together. This is like a solid foundation that you're building on three. I talk about the three and the solid foundation, read it, look it up if you want to, in terms of scientific terms, but this is like something that's coming together, people that are coming together to make this work. So you might expect to you know, the more that you put energy into, the more that you work with people and collaborate, you're going to see this build and grow just, just really wonderfully Pisces. So this is your power in this situation. Let's have a look at what the outcome is and what you need to know, because there's money showing up, friends. There's money showing up. There's opportunities showing up. So this is about your plans, Pisces. This is about your plans. When you have a plan in play, I think you're going to be really surprised at what presents itself. What It's interesting for some of you that I'm getting through is that for some of you, you might think that there's not an opportunity now because you see maybe other people in that position, other people where you want to be. Just something of that nature seems to be just standing out right now with this tower energy. But I feel what's happening is there's going to be like a restructure happening. Okay. Um, so maybe this is in your workplace. Maybe this is in terms of friendship. Maybe this is in terms of the family dynamic. There's just some restructure that I feel is happening and people that once were in a certain place are no longer going to be there or going to shift and move to other things, other people, other places. So this is really setting you up 
for success, but you, you don't see it. Okay. And you, you just, I think you don't see it. You may not be aware of it, but I feel like this is what's happening for you in your favor, supporting this path and journey, but you've got to take a chance. You've got to have this belief and knowing that the miracle arrives when you just let it go and allow the universe to work in your favor. Okay. Um, the four of cups too. I just, I feel you, you, you're going to miss this Pisces. If you're not paying attention. Okay. If you don't have a plan because you're worried or you're just thinking it's not going to work out, the reality is it won't work out if that's how you feel about it. But if you have a plan and, and go on, I'm going to, you know, it's kind of like writing that mission statement or that vision of your life and reading it every day and every night it happens. And I'm going to tell you, I had a goal. Okay. Uh, this was at the end of last year. I had a goal of how much money that I wanted in my bank account and it was six figures and I did it in three months and it's something that I never expected would happen. Not that I was believing that way because I had a belief that I can do this and I can make this happen, but it happened because I kept holding that vision. And like I said, strange, wonderful things happen when you hold the faith, when you release and surrender to it. You still got to do the work, but things fall into place when you allow it. Okay. And I feel this is really important for you right now because I, that might be a piece that you, that you might be missing here, Pisces. Okay. So furthermore, we have got page of pentacles, the Hierophant energy and the eight of swords. So I feel Pisces here. Your faith or a trusted confidant is going to be incredibly powerful for you as you work through this and as you navigate through this. I, I'm seeing something here that you're not believing in or that you just have this little bit of lack energy or someone around you might be instilling some thoughts that aren't helpful or supportive. And there might be a bit of a disconnect to how you think and how you feel and you're trying to match that up, okay? What I'm seeing here though is opportunities are still will present itself, but I feel it's, this is going to give you the hope that you need. It may not be huge and big. And, um, as you move through, we definitely see the wealth and opportunities coming on through, but I feel like if this is like a step and point in time, there's multiple avenues that this is coming. There's multiple avenues of wealth creation and things that are growing and things that you're like accumulating. Okay. And I feel they're going to come in different values. Some things might be big, some things might be smaller, but it's all going to add up really, really wonderfully for you. As I said, with this Hierophant energy, I just, I feel you're, you're supported and having a confidant right now or someone that you lean into to keep those spirit and energy high is going to be incredibly important Pisces. I just think there's a little bit of a mindset game for you that you might be battling within yourself. The clarity will come through as we see that Mercury stations direct as well. Okay. That there's just a lot of good energy coming. So really please believe in this. We're going to get some final messages for you with the healing waters Oracle. What are the final messages for Pisces? Final messages. We have got ride the waves, life lessons and growth. You will get through this. I did talk about some life lesson here, Pisces, that we, we need to learn and work through. And I feel this is incredibly important. We've got metamorphosis, embrace transformation. Things are different now. So things are changing, Pisces, and changing in your favor, changing in supporting you. But the first thing that you need to do is support yourself and being kind to the way that you are towards yourself, kind to the way you think about yourself. And just, again, remember your power and how powerful you are. And it all starts from within and the way that you approach and be mindful of self. Because I think sometimes we're just so good at supporting other people. And sometimes we lack that compassion and care for ourselves that we truly need. Um, but this is happening for you, Pisces. And I love it. Let's bring it. We'll speak soon.